Welcome back to Deus Ex Mankind Divided. We've arrived at the Libuse Apartments, following up on the underground neon trade. Apparently there should be a door marked with a swan somewhere in this place. So let's keep an eye out for it, but we're just going to wander around and explore. Hopefully we'll just come across it. Is this like a merchant or just... I mean, that's, a, <laughs> that's one of the storage blockers. Someone's using that as an office? I can see that there's nothing in those. And I can see that there's, I think, crafting parts in there. That's not much, but it's something. It's going to get us from here and here. Okay, that's fine. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Oh. I think I disconnected in time. So the reason I hesitated there is because I've realized there's some other things you can get, uh, like this data store. I don't know what the data store gives you necessarily, but sometimes you see things called spam, and I think if you hit the spam things, it gives you, like, I don't know, some sort of a, maybe it's a stop worm or something like that. It gives you some sort of a thing that you can use in the future. So I want to try hitting those if I can. I trying to hold off, but... Okay, yeah, we have plenty of time. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. So see what this data store gives us. Oh, just a hundred credits. Access granted. Yeah, hundred credits really isn't that much, so that's not too important, the data stores I guess. But the spam things. Would love them. Love me some spam. Shh. Where do these go? So I can go up. Okay, that just goes to the other storage unit. Oh, is that related to the quest? Nobody here? I think I may have found my- oh yeah, there's this one. Okay, <laughs> I guess we've entered the right apartment. They have a bunch of swans. Security rating four. How many multi tools do I have? Three. Okay, I want to keep two on hand for the director's apartment. I can use one. Cool, we get a multi-tool from it. Come on, pocket secretary. Any minute now. Thank you. From sickness, or no, to sickness. Neon lab codes. Ooh. <laughs> they have a lab. Uh, change in plan, sickness. It's getting too tough for me to smuggle neon out of the lab. The Diwali guards are on to me. It'll be safer if we organize some kind of pickup. The lab is underground beneath the Zelen apartment complex. Find the generators, and you find the lab. There are two doors you will have to pass. The code to both of them is 0311. Sounds easy, right? Problem is, they've installed a turret between those two doors. Scope things out when you can and tell me what you think. Harmony. 
We need the Zillin apartment complex. I'm pretty sure that's the apartment complex where Adam Jensen lives. This is such a long quest line. I love it. I feel like I'm really being a detective. Wait, wait, wait. I can press the spray bottle. What? Are all spray bottles in this universe, you, you press them once, they shoot backwards as if they just shot a bullet out of them, they make no noise, nothing actually comes out, and then that's it, they're spent? This really is the future. So your vision... Yeah, I don't think your vision... No, it, your special vision does not tell you, even with the magpie upgrade, that there are items inside of a drawer. That's unfortunate. Ah, right. Remember, they're a, a cleaning front. That's their front, is that they come and clean your apartment, or your house, or whatever, but in reality, they just drop off drugs. But I guess I need actual equipment to uh, make the front believable. Hence all the towels and vacuums. I love this magpie vision. Are the buildings of the future just really weak? Because there's so many walls that are structurally weak. It's worrisome. Is this the future we want? Will I actually fit that in my inventory? Yeah, it looks like the inventory auto arranges itself to fit things. Unlocked. Odd. This one's also from Katarina. Dear Cleaners, I heard about a new service in Prague that makes special deliveries, organizes parties and secret raves in the sewers. Any of this sound familiar? If there's a way to get Neon without going through Bon Bon and her gang, I want to know about it. The world is so black and white, but neon is color. Neon is life. Please, I can be discreet, and I can pay. They really went too far with the swan thing. I mean, this person just has a swan problem. It's an obsession. Something happened in 202. Cygnus, I went to 33 Halavni like you asked, to the Neon Knights party. You're right about the kid. I'm sure now that he can be trusted. He doesn't like the Diwali any more than we do. The others, I think, are okay as well. Except a girl named Katarina who looks like trouble to me. Not Diwali kind of trouble, just trouble trouble. Anyway, something happened at the party that we have to talk about. I saw a side of Neon I've never seen before. I suspect you already know what I'm talking about. Okay, I think that's it for this place. I'm actually going to go ahead and go back the way I came, because there's another pathway in these vents. Or actually not those vents, but here. Whoa. Biosol Hypostimin credits. Nice.
Uh, looks like... Ooh. Yeah, it's heading to a restricted zone. Where are we? There's nobody here, though. Pilgrim Station. Is this underground? I have no idea where I am, really. Like, in relation to anything else. Oh well, let's take advantage of it. Nobody here. Restricted zone, probably some goodies to get. Should I knock him out? Can I knock somebody out who's in a chair? No, looks like you can't. I could probably get their attention though and they'd probably come out of the chair. But I don't think we need to bother with them. Oh, what is that? I've been trying to get a hold of it. There's something up there, but I'd have to move the box which would definitely get their attention. Maybe I should make a distraction, actually. Let's do that. Let's grab something. Oh. That didn't work at all. If you do hear from them, please let me know. Huh. Okay. That's another one of those weird triangle code things that I don't care about. To staff all, homeless problem. Attention all, while it's sad to see so many people on the streets, we can't just leave the station open to anyone wandering in and hiding themselves away. Homeless or not, it's not great for paying customers and poses a serious security issue in light of the recent attacks. I have spoken with the powers that be and they have agreed to install new security equipment. I'm going to be out for the day, so when the security guy from Sobchok shows up, someone will need to let him into the server room and keep him happy. Keypad code is 9143. I don't know how she is. Scared of everything. Now, the area over here is not restricted, so we should be fine. Why not me? Yeah. Yeah, we're fine. <laughs> Wait a minute. This. Hold on. Behind here is not restricted? This is not restricted. Okay. Access to employee area. Hello, Davis. Welcome aboard. Not sure if you received this in your welcome package. Did you get your welcome package? But in case not, here's your magic number. The code for the employees only area. I know what you're thinking. How exclusive. But it's not really. Everyone gets one. Anyways, glad you could join us. See you around. Oh shit, I almost forgot the code. It's 2548. Damn line is down, but we can't get clearance to work on it. The investigation is ongoing. Already read that one? Don't think I even have the right yes, this is obviously one of the metro stations. Is this... Have we been in this one, though? Oh, right, Miller, I'm it's at the metro. where the pills Welcome go. Timing. Chang says your private chariot will arrive any time you call up Razika Station on the map. Chang, you had him hack into Prague's public yeah. transit company so I can get to Razika? Plan A wasn't working. They can just hack the metro system? Cool. But yeah, it's where the uh, the pills go. Okay.
All right, well, we're back to... Oh, look at that backpack. Backpack of the future, it's got Here like... comes another one. It's got that, like, futuristic armor plating look. And flags from all sorts of countries. But yeah, let's check out the rest of the apartments. Kinda found what I needed to find early. Oh, they got on-site laundry. Nice. I love this magpie vision. That's where I just was. Yeah, must be. Guess I never opened the front door. This place is just open? growing out of control. How is it even possible that they haven't toppled over? That is quite a collection. Lots of cigarettes, lots of beer, lots of pizza. And they just leave the door unlocked. Absinthe? Oh, that was a bio cell. Oh <laughs> they never shower. <laughs> the shower is just a storage room. There, enjoy some wet boxes. Neuropazine, nice. Yeah, I need to go back to that person that was offering uh, neuropazine for information, or rather the other way around, offering information for my neuropazine. That's it, aside from some more alcohol. Ah, security rating 3. Do I have any Praxis? I don't think I do. No, I've got zero. Actually, do I have enough parts to make another multi-tool? I don't. Even if I did, I don't know if it'd be worth it on just a security level 3 thing. I think I'd want to save it for like 4 and 5. There's a 4. Also, I need to check every time I see something. I need to look over here and see if I already have the password for it, because I've collected so many passwords that I don't know exactly what they're for. That any one of these could be one that I have a password to. Oh, this one's easy. Mr. Reveal. Oh my god, this is the easiest. I just go here and then here. Okay. Anomaly. Trace program in access granted. I love that there's so much hidden stuff that you can find behind boxes and things. I bet they made that probably mostly for people with magpie vision. Like, I feel like I'm being rewarded, not just with being able to find stuff that's kind of hard to see, but finding stuff that seems like it was specifically made for only people that have the special vision, or people that really, really like to move every single little box and see if something's behind it. That's cool. Feels good. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. What were they doing in this apartment? Is 
very strange, very empty. There's nothing in the kitchen. They completely boarded over this window. Let's take in the bigger picture here. Now it looks like they're doing detective work of some sort. It's a conversation. Uh, AK-99 and Kelv. Uh, Kelly, you there? Ari, something wrong with the parts I sent you? No, it's something else. The key to that insurance I was telling you about. You're still planning that. I told you, Ari. They don't care about you anymore. You ceased to exist after they fired us. Then why do I still have the headaches? Why do I still need the... The Nupos? Is that a sh short name for neuropathy? Nupos? There's no chip. You have PTSD. Everybody in our line of business does. That's all it is. You can get help, but you'll need to talk to someone. You want me to end up on an official file? Forget it. No. They want to scratch that chapter out of history, including us. Whatever's in that vault is the key to buying my safety when they finally find me. If anything happens to me, you can get the key yourself. It's in my store lockbox. Okay, uh, give me the code, and nothing is going to happen to you. No chance, I'm not writing it down. It's the year we started working together, before it all went bad. Christ, it's the last time I remember not having to look over my shoulder. Fine, but I don't see how you're expecting to use this. You're just going to walk in. Who do you think is guarding the place? Things wouldn't have changed that much. Fine. Look, man, I've got to go. I just hope you know what you're doing. Hmm. You have PTSD. Everybody in our line of business does. What is their line of business? Something that puts them in incredibly stressful situations. From Palisade Bank. Uh, welcome to the Palisade Property Bank. All the preliminary checks have been completed. We are now able to proceed with the final details involved in opening your new account. Okay. Alright. Yeah, not much to read there. You can read it if you want. They've opened an account at Palisade Bank. The year they started working together. I don't have that information at all. Can I just say how incredibly satisfying it is to just walk around an apartment complex and hack into almost everybody's apartment? It's so satisfying. It's so privacy invading, but still so satisfying. Let's see. Ooh, it's gonna get to me pretty quick. It's gonna come here and then here. I don't know what this transfer does. But uh, I'm definitely going to want to capture these just to fortify them. Alright, we should be good. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Oh, they got a studio. Photographer? Oh, <laughs> those are fancy lights. Cool. How do you turn them on or off, though? They don't seem to have any switches or anything. What's their power source? Some expensive equipment. Whoa, what? Did that picture just slide up? 
Just because I examined this thing? Alright, cool. I'm glad I examined it. Ah, security rating 3. Let's see, we can actually see what's inside, right? Well, sort of. Pocket secretary and... Something else, maybe a credit chip? Hmm. I'll just leave it. Another structural weakness. I don't have any frag grenades, do I? Nope. Just EM whoop. EMP, gas, and smoke. I do have a mine template. Just a template though, I don't I don't know what to even do with that. Here, what is that? What is it? Is it a coffee maker? I think it is. Next floor. Oh, wait. There is no higher floor, is there? Hmm. -mm. Okay, so I've got two quests for this district over here. Two side quests that I want to do. I've, I still have the confront or talk to the person doing the document forging. That's kind of like one of the first quests I got, so I've still got that. And now... The Neon Quest has us going back to this district as well, someplace underneath the Zelen apartment complex. So I think I want to go back there and perhaps do both. So we got a metro right here. And something I'm curious about with the metro is what if I get on the human train again? Last time I did that, one Can't of the... Take that kick back. Who are you talking to? <laughs> uh, last time we did that, one of the cops said, like, don't take this, you know, don't take the human carriage again. Or, or else. I wonder if there will be an or else that we'll encounter. So that's the AUG only carriage over there. I'm going to go on a human one. So that's where we are right now. Ah, so that's where we want to go. Prakazga. I'm sure that's not even close to how it's pronounced. I'm just ignoring the... The thingies over the letters. <laughs> I don't even know what they're called. Here we go. Let's see if this is a problem. byla velká chyba. Jed ve voze, kam Augové nesmějí? To by vás mohlo přijít draho. Ukažte mi doklady. Wrong train car. Right. They're all going to the same place, aren't they? Na stejný místo? Hmm. No jasně, že jedou na stejný místo. Je to stejný vlak, vy idiote. Tady. Údaje souhlasej, ale už to příště nedělejte. Hmm. Well, we got a different person this time. So... Maybe it's fine? What if we get the same person multiple times, though? Ah, the first district. Smells like... an augmented ghetto and swamp water. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far. Then when I return, I'm gonna continue the Neon Quest.